say that you, you've mastered the G, C, and D open chords. What else can be done with these three chords here, in, like in terms of voicings and yeah, and and and, and the different positions? I guess we're going to get to uh, to the gentleman's question now. Yeah, I feel like we kind of hinted at, but when you say like how many there, I mean it depends. There's so many ways to voice it alone. If you, even just within the cage shapes, you know, we have G. Here's another G. Mm -hmm. Here's another. So I'm walking up the cage shape. The G. The G version of G. The E shape version of G. Your D shape version of G. It's kind of like mm -hmm. a D. Your C shape, but G chord. A shape, but G chord. And even up here, it's different. Like this mm -hmm. is the same, same notes, an octave up. And so you can do just like comping wise. You can do so much within it. Mm -hmm. Um, and then soloing the same thing. Like for me, I visualize the guitar with those shape, with those shapes. So I see the shapes moving, um, and I, I use that as a kind of a key point for improvisation as well. Oh. Using those, like you know. Right, you're you're linking one version of a G chord to another, but with, with sliding up on a particular string. Like you're going from from you went from. From uh, this, the E shape at the third fret, and then I, you, you slid probably up on your D string. Now you're up in this, this voicing here, and then you yeah. can do a. And now that's kind of the, the A shape version. Yeah, so you're you can kind of link those different caged versions of the G chord. Hopefully this is this is kind of you know and and um, what about well you know <laughs> I know I did about a month ago uh, a holiday technique of the week and I played Frosty the Snowman kind of a surf version Fine. so I played the melody and what I found was easier to play the melody if I played it in the key of G and the chords are G C and D really um, starting in my C shape D This is the C E shape right when I do that. It's a D, kind of the G shape with the D chords over. Yeah. And you probably G, went C D. Go ahead, yeah. I was gonna say you probably like went through a bunch of ver voicings of it because it's kind of fun, even like for you are my sunshine. Mm -hmm. I can play it here. You kind of like see what feels right what sounds right what yeah and that's exactly what that. happened that's exactly what happened actually I, I thought i was going to do the whole thing out of this shape but then because of just one passage i decided to, to change it real around and you know at the, at the top i played a happy birthday and i made sure i did it in the open shape but so paul molly could i ask you can you play something play, uh, um even if it, it's your my sunshine could you play it in an open chord and then do it in a different voicing just kind of give us a real clear a and b if you will of what it's like yeah. an open voicing and then a, a closed one totally yeah because i did that even in within like the first thing i did i, I played it up here or down here rather mm -hmm. You get all those open strings, all that those good vibrations versus mm -hmm. up here, I'll play like in the A shape. Different timbre, different mm -hmm. vibe. Yeah. You just watched a preview of Fender Play's Cage System Major Scales Collection. Click the link to learn more guitar scales, then put your skills to use by learning to play the songs you love. The Fender Play app offers a completely customizable learning experience for anyone who wants to learn to play guitar, bass, or ukulele. You can track your progress while you learn to play using over 3,000 lessons and innovative practice features like backing tracks, practice mode, and weekly gear giveaways. Click the link to sign up for your free trial of Fender Play today. No credit card required.